Hey everybody, this is Dumb Dumb Dog. How y'all doing? Um, I, I'm going to do a follow-up video for myself and for anybody who's interested. Because this is kind of like a, a replay. Uh, if I don't step back to a deck for a while, I want to come back and watch it. Uh, watch myself uh, sound like an idiot, talk about it, and then maybe I'll remember how to play the deck. Um, I just made this deck, and I just played it a little while ago, and I found it very successful. Um, and I made a mistake. Uh, I accidentally uh, was thinking two, two cards, and I accidentally dropped two Void Steel Daggers just right off the bat. Oops. And that mistake taught me that it was not a mistake, because if you look at the penetration, it's 16. And, and to get, so I get damage and a penetration right away, damage and penetration right away, and then I built onto my baby card. It just, it, it, something about it felt right. It just, uh, I'll work on the math. Um, it worked for the situation, sort of. Let's go, let me go do a breakdown of a uh, ninja, ninja episode. And the reason I call it episode is when I used to play Skyrim, my wife or then girlfriend would come home and I would have been playing Skyrim and she was really into watching me play the kitty character. And because I was all ninja-like and walking and sneaking and hiding. And, and since I'm a photographer, I've got like cinematic sort of, I would walk in such a way to give a better cinematic view so it wouldn't get sickening for her to watch. And that would be my constraint in finishing really hard paddles. Um, and then she would like, you know, like I would like save right before a cool battle and then uh, play it out through the day, kick its butt, move through, but I would replay the episode, uh, uh huh, like TV, and you know we we would we would play it sort of together, and she'd watch it, and just she loved watching that little kitty kick everybody's butt. It just it it was like watching worldwide wrestling for that's what it became, and that's kind of what Paragon's becoming. Um, and, and hey guys, we're in our our well in our forties well inside our 40s so we we are the the early we, we're we are sort of what young kids are going to become and th this is exactly what i thought the video game world adults playing games having fun you know it's uh it's a great way to it's a great thing to do sort of in your retirement all right here we go i know i rambled Sorry. Um, so I got little baby. So I got a little baby dagger here. Got a little baby dagger here. And what I do is two daggers. This dagger ends up in my, my final hand. This dagger ends up in my final hand. This is optional. This is uh, permanent. Uh, this is, uh, I start this early for the penetration, extra penetration. Uh, I don't upgrade these in, unless I've got spare points hanging around. Uh, this is an easy whammo. I got six points. Oh, well, I've got a crit bonus. Um, and, and that's kind of, you know, uh, this is an optional card. Uh, it can take the place of uh, uh, all three card, I do believe, or, yeah, yep, yep, yep. So, there's a little flexibility. I can speed up, I can go towards, uh, but if you notice, I'm basing it a lot on penetration. And that's it. Because I'm thinking, like, uh, a stiletto is a long thin dagger and it can actually just be a small pointy rod uh, and you 
it was developed to kill people in chain mail uh, you did, or even plate mail. It would just puncture the armor, go right through the chain mail, and right into the person. So that, you know, that's that, that's where, what stilettos were used for uh, to begin, you know. And that's kind of what I'm basing this on. Let's go watch a really quick episode. I will, I don't know, I'll try to make this less painful somehow, but I'm not going to edit it. I'm just going to know to skip around. 19 hours ago, personal. Um, that didn't end well. I don't think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, uh, Grux did not even start the game. It was AFK, and then he ran in, and AFK for 90% of the game, and then ran in at the end and died eight times because he is low level, so he could respawn back quicker and die fast. You know, boop, 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 boop. It was... Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was for a moment there. We we were doing pretty good, and then, all right, where is it? Now I just look. Oh wait. Oh, me. Oh, okay, yeah. Nope. Here, he picked last. This guy picked after I picked. He didn't show what he wanted to be. And then all of a sudden, he's this guy. We, he's not a wave clearer. I'm, the ninja's truly not a wave clearer by any stretch of the imagination. It, it was doomed to fail. Uh, Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, I see a lot of failure. Do y'all see a lot of failure? I do. I I just it's if you could just give me a quantum computer and let me play all five players at different times and they all end up playing together at once. That's what I want. All right, let's do our MOBA. Let's start with Dum Dum. Let's speed up the speed. Woo, let's check our little ninja out. Oh, yeah. I got a little confused here. Uh, I'm doing a little, I nicked them. I came in and nicked the thing and I just stood and absorbed the EXP. I wanted to show them I'm not a dick. <laughs> I do the same thing here because I'm going to get the card points and I'm going to get, I'm just, if you notice, I went around in case he dropped off and tried to loop him around. I was just playing a uh, little backup. That's all I was doing. I didn't even have to go touch them. Let me get a little sip of coffee here. I dip in, I, I go off and on. You see the circle? Do you see the circle right here? I'm looking, you know, look, I'm zoning for that guy. I know that just, that showed him. I'm taking more damage. I'm just holding the creep wave. That's why I took so much damage because I didn't want that creep wave to walk under my tower. I wanted them to push closer to my tower. You see? Do you see how that worked? I did. I created. I I fought them with the creep wave. It's a ninja way. It's it's a ninja way. Any hero can do it that way. Uh, 
Yep. What time is it? 4.30. Maybe 4.19 was the moment I stepped onto the uh, harvester. I don't know. Oh, look, did that ninja just walk through a trap? Oh, that's crazy. Let's go look at my cards. I got three points sitting in the, in the pool. Oh, I'm going to do a terminology uh, episode where I go over my terminology. And I'm going to do that mostly to lock myself into m meanings because I use a lot of the same words for different things. And look at me. He went for me and not... Oh, that's... Notice I'm, uh, I'm a ward. Players are wards also. It's how you stand. It's how you look. I don't have my ult yet. I'm about to drop. I've already got, oh, here's a dagger, dagger. I usually put down a ward. I, it was some sort of mistake. I might have been thinking two cards. I don't know. Like if you dropped two twos, you can drop three twos, but not four twos. Does that make sense? Or something like that. I'd have to go, I don't want to tease that out at the moment. Let's get back to the ninja. Boop. I attacked the guy in the back. I attacked their support, nicked them, ran away. Let's look at that again. Because I'm not trying to kill, I'm trying to create position. Let's, and, and I'm honestly doing this in the moment. All right, let's go to me. See, he's in the back. I, I'm posturing, I'm posturing. I'm out of there. This is the guy I nicked. That's the guy I nicked. That's the guy I nicked. Alright, FYI, stand right here when you want to teleport, or st stand over there, or run behind the harvester. Hide your teleport line, man. Hide your teleport line. Let's get back to the, the dumb, dumb show. Look at me, I'm begging for help, and this, this doesn't end well. Let's, let's speed this up. And I say it doesn't end well because what happens is I get off task. All right. You see our dude here? He's right there. He's right there. He's right there. He's right there. Or no, this. Is that what happened? Nope. I called for help and only one guy came. And now everybody's coming. And I asked what I wanted, had everybody come, and then because Gideon came in first, I stayed in the fight way, I went invisible, I let Gideon do some fighting, and I popped my visibility, I, I, I revealed myself while my cooldown was still uh, going, and uh, I died. That's uh, how I saw it. The reason I break down fights like this, uh, I've been trained in Taekwondo to break down uh, minute battles and give detailed uh, what you think happened. And then the person t says what they think happened. And you sit there and you talk about it. And it does nothing but improve your sparring and your technique. Uh, crazily enough, I've killed three people. I don't think of, we've noticed this. Is that me? No, I haven't. 
I'm over here doing stuff. I was watching the wrong guy. All right, I did die once. I think we saw that. But I've gotten two assists. I set up some weirdness over here. I tried to set up some weirdness over here, but failed. I think we're the enemy. I'm not sure now. Yeah, these are our guys dying. It's okay. I mean, I do get a moment of farm. There are a million different ways. Uh, I'm not sure. Where's this guy? He's there. I'm not trying to kill anybody. I'm just trying to do the thing. Nick him. Kept him from this fight over here. And I'll be back. Whoop. That fight's still going on. If you notice, I'm not really hitting the harvesters yet because I couldn't find the space to do it. I couldn't force it. It was all my menu. I just couldn't force it. I couldn't get in there. Because, you know. But now we're starting to... To work together, to, you know, look at this. See that diagonal line in the mini-map there? This diagonal line. Right here. See that diagonal line? See it? Now, they're moving off this way. This is probably going to end well for us. I'm sneaking up behind, you know, this This is the whole, I picked, still to Nick, right? Still was the most important person to Nick, and it's still going to pay off. It's still going to pay off. Because I was helping Fang try to get away, and still was the guy to Nick, and still's dead, And in, it could have been worse, I think. It could have been worse. All right. Let's see what happens. Notice, I actually waited to use my ult. I was gonna, I was trying to get to the tower without even using my ult. That's me practicing my dagger. And you know what? The dagger shot helped pay off, didn't it? But that's it wasn't the point. Somebody else took advantage of the chaos. We're at the point. I've dropped this ward, which is unupgradable, but it's got penetration in it. I've got my little baby card, and I've got a little baby card. So this is uh, this has got uh, three ones in it, probably, and this has got nothing in it, and I dropped a ward, and I've got penetration, penetration, penetration. So this is the stiletto approach. And the reason I call it Ninja Light is I only have two consumables in my pocket. A healing potion and I think energy armor, which I never put on the entire game. It's just a one-pointer in energy armor. I actually saved Fang's life in that little exchange right there. I, I that's the way I remember it. Let's uh, um, 
回事儿是？二分三。Wish we could see from my perspective. Ah, you see him? You see him? Maybe that wasn't it. Here we go. I moved for perspective. See, he was right on him. One more punch, and Fang would have been dead. And then, boom! Fang killed the guy I think that was just about to lay down the hammer on him. And this is me、uh, celebrate something. Ooh, I got a nice fanny. Did you see how pretty my fanny looked? I shut it to you again. Woohoo! I'm mooning the other team. Woohoo! All right. Well, that's Ninja Ways.、Uh, my my score was at the end of this. Three, one, four. And that's Ninja Ways, everybody. Will y'all have a fun time? Fun time in Paragon. Don't forget to moon your enemy. Everybody have a nice, nice time. I chat with you later. <laughs>